Hi, this is Aprajita from Avaya Serviceability Engineering team. In this video, we will see how to resolve fail to import EPM key error during MPP installation for Avaya Aura Experience Portal. It often happens during the installation of MPP software that we encounter this error which says fail to import key from the specified host. Please check the following URL http slash slash epm server slash cert.pem where epm server is generally the ip address or domain name of experience portal manager in most of the cases this error is generated because of the firewalls enabled on the experience portal manager side so let's see how to rectify this Begin with logging into Experience Portal Manager's command line access with root login. Now we'll check the status of IP table service by giving command service IP tables status. This output shows that the firewall is enabled on the system. So let's try to stop the service now. Let's issue a command check config hyphen hyphen del IP tables followed by service IP tables stop. If we look at the output here, it is stop the firewall for this system. Let us verify the status of IP table service on this system by issuing command service IP table status again. Now the output says that the firewall is not running. Now we will try to import Experience Portal Manager's certificate file here by issuing command curl http colon slash slash IP address of Experience Portal Manager slash cert.pem. If we look at the output here, begin certificate and end certificate shows that the certificate has been imported successfully. To make these changes effective on the system, we will have to restart the VPMS service here. So let's issue command service VPMS restart. It will try to stop all the components related to this service one by one. VPMS shutdown status OK shows that the service has been stopped successfully. Now it is trying to start all the components. VPMS start status OK means that the VPMS service has been restarted successfully on this system. Now the last step of this exercise would be trying to access web administration of Experience Portal Manager. So let's try logging in there. This home page shows that we don't have any negative impact of disabling firewall for Experience Portal Manager. Now you can go ahead with your MPP installation. You won't face the same error again. Thank you for your time today. I hope this information will be helpful. For any questions, comments or feedback, please write to mentor at avaya.com or follow us on Twitter at avaya mentor. Thank you for choosing avaya.